We all know about incandescent lamps. They are frequently used in automobile lightning, lanterns, and they frequently go out of order. This may be caused both by the fusion of the lamp and its physical tearing. This, however, is not typical of light diodes. But how do you insert the light diodes into the lamp igniting primer? I can offer you non-traditional solution. Just solder the light diode into the lamp suckle, thus producing a small light diode lamp. Remove the glass flack. Take the compound out of it. You will not require it. Remove the phases conducting the current to the incandescent thread. Now you have a hollow lamp suckle. Take the large diode and solder a 1 kilo ohm resistor to one of the outlets so as to use the lamp at the voltage of 12 volts. Cover outlet with flux. And do the same for the resistor outlet. I have somewhat shortened it so that it would fit into the lamp socle. Now solder the resistor to the light diode. Have in mind that one of the resistor outlets is positive. Positive current is typically supplied to the central outlet of the lamp in automobile lightning. So for the light diode to work, the positive outlet has to fit into the central outlet of the suckle. Now carefully remove the solder from the central outlet of the lamp with a soldering iron so as to form a hole where you insert the resistor outlet. You had better disguise it in the heat shrinkage so as to avoid short circuit with a suckle frame. Then fix the resistor, solder it to the central outlet of the suckle carefully. Biting off the extra part of the outlet. Do the same for the second outlet. Now you may use the newly made light diode lamp. Try more careful soldering. Now turn it on and see how it works. Supply 12 volts and see how the light diode shines. It would be especially good to use a cell-made light diode lamp in various devices, 
requiring a lamp with a special circle not in stock on the market. The lamp will do you good service so that you don't have to look for a lamp with a rare circle all over the city.